in July, we told you about the possibility that Seagull Bay Yacht Club in American Falls could shut down. The Bureau of Reclamation felt there were regulations that needed to be met for it to remain open. Local News 8's Misty Inglet has kept an eye on this issue for us. She's live now from a Pocatello newsroom with an update. So, Misty, has this issue been resolved now? It has, Jay. So, the BOR and the Yacht Club have had several meetings since then, and they've come to an agreement. The Yacht Club will remain operational. Right now, Seagull Bay is empty for the season, but it won't stay deserted for long. The Seagull Bay Yacht Club put together an operating plan, which the Bureau of Reclamation accepted. Part of that plan is that the club will partner with Power County and its Waterways Committee to run Seagull Bay. What that means is that the Bureau now can give us matching funds when the government entity is involved. So if we can write some grants and then the Bureau will match those, we can expand the recreation area, improve the services, everything. One of the issues has been public versus private use. The BOR felt there were not enough public RV camping spots. By partnering with the county for available funding, it can expand Seagull Bay. It has a long-term plan to have 60 RV camping spots. Doug Balfour says both Power and Bingham counties have been very supportive in keeping it open. This is mainly because the bay serves as a quicker launching pad for search and rescue teams. The club says it's glad an agreement could be reached. The Yacht Club and I are very happy that the Bureau of Reclamation has seen the value of having the Yacht Club here operating this. I think they realized that uh, without the Yacht Club here, this place would shut down, would not work. Now, right now, the club is waiting on a memorandum from the BOR on its partnership with Power County. But the club says other than dotting the I's and crossing the T's to finalize everything, this issue has been resolved. And the club says it looks forward to opening again next season. Live in the Pocatello newsroom tonight, I'm Misty Inglet. All right, thank you, Misty. Sounds like a win-win situation there. And the Commodore of the Yacht Club wrote a thank you letter to the community about this. We've included that on our website at localnews8.com.